um, it, it was it was a great experience, and the girls were very uh, happy to see us. They, they were very uh, excited, um, loved to dance, loved to do things, loved to talk. So it was a good experience. I'm uh, going to be uh, doing the um, tour, okay. and uh, this this is my first experience. This is my first tour, so um, my dilemma, my dilemma is this: really, um, I've been corresponding with a uh, couple women in particular from that region, and um, you know, it's uh, really you know, really you know, just speaking honestly with each other and developing kind of a good you know, exchange, but obviously until I meet these people, you know, we don't know what we have. So right. my my attitude is I want to go have a vacation, have a cool time, you know, but I want to, you know, I, my intention is to, you know, um, get with these with these girls and, you know, on the side and just, you know, see what is there. So my dilemma is how, how would you advise me as far as balancing that, you know, I'm just... Um, well, it sounds like you're already so, uh, doing that. I mean, it sounds like you're already writing to some of the women, which is fine. There's nothing wrong with writing before you go. I wouldn't get too invested in the letters because you never know what's going to happen when you meet in person. So, you know, write the letters, but keep it kind of light. Don't start saying, I love you, I love you, I love you in the letters exactly. because, right. you know, God knows what will happen when you meet. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> it's all, yeah, it's all about meeting and the chemistry. I would give our office a list of the women you think you want to meet when you get there. Let us work on getting them invited to the social or... Some of the women would prefer not to go to a social to meet you. Some of the women would prefer to meet you on a one-on-one -on -one basis, which is just fine. We'll just set that up for you as well. on the socials, meet the women that you can when you're at the socials that you're interested in, um, mm -hmm. meet these women that you've been writing to, obviously, set up some dates with them, I mean, some of the guys, as soon as they get there, they do a date that evening, and, you know, as long as you can, you know, get over that jet lag quick enough, you're not too wiped out from the trip, <laughs> go out with a woman the first night, I mean, it's better than, you know, listening to us, I mean, I, even though I want you to listen to the orientation, because that's important, we give you all the do's and don'ts. Anything that can possibly happen, we go over all that with you at the orientation, and then you have a meeting with interpreter that the interpreters that first night, so you see who's going to be there if you need help with interpreters. But you know, right after that meeting, you can just go out, and the guys usually go out to dinner with either some of the interpreters or themselves. So you can set up a date for the first night when you get there. I mean, you don't. I'll tell you that time when you first get there, you feel like you have a lot of time, but that time goes by so fast. When at the end of the tour, you're going to be saying, "What? I got to go? What happened to all the time? It just goes, man. It just right." Right. So I so it's okay. I, I shouldn't be shy about as far as explaining to these ladies, hey, you know, um, w you know, as far as, would they be open minded as far as coming to the social, or maybe they wouldn't want to. But I should, you know, not be shy about you know communicating. Don't be shy. Them. Ask them. They say, look, I, you know, I'm going to do these socials because I'm going with these guys, and that's what they do. We we go to these socials and meet people. But I want to meet you. I'm writing to you. So we can either meet the social, or I'll meet you before the social, or after the social, or the, when the first time they get there, whatever. You know, I just want to meet you, um, and I'm sure that they'll they'll meet you. All right. Okay. Cool. Yeah. I'm just I'm just not used to that sort of directness that you know you guys were saying that you know these women are really direct. So I guess I'm used to American women that kind of beat around the bush. So no, no, these women are pretty direct. I mean, when you sit down next to them at the table, they'll, they'll look at you and say, "So why'd you come all the way over here? Okay. Hey, have a great time. Let me know how it goes when you get back. Okay? Oh, I, I sure will. Thanks. I'm right, a good mood on this guy. Thank you so much. Interested? Learn more at... If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Then click on the notice bell to get notified every time we add something new.